notify guys me and my dad are going to take a trip to our storage uh, compound where we store a few other cars uh, mainly projects of my dad's that he's never probably going to get around to but we're going to go to the storage place and i'll show you what we keep down there I actually thought we were taking the uh, rangey, turns out we are going in the, my parents are bath, let's go. Beautiful. So this is our caravan that we keep at our storage unit. For some reason there's not enough space over there, the rest of ours, so we keep in the caravan over here with a few others. And then we've got our project cars where my dad is at the moment over there. I think today my dad's going to check to make sure there's no damp in it. Because really we need to get it home, give it a good clean, as there's no cover over the top of the roof which we also need really to stop it getting damp. So this is actually a rare little van. This is a Seat Terra van. My dad just told me it's got a 903 cc engine with a four speed gearbox. It's actually a little camper van. I don't really know why they bought it, but when they bought it, it was roadworthy. It had MOT, but now all we've got is a flat tire a lot of grime and no MOT because I believe it needs welding it failed when we took it in for them it's basically the same as a Fiat van it's got the same lights as a Fiat Panda at the front so it's got two rear doors here my dad decided that it would be cool to sticker bomb it so we've got various sticker bombs <laughs> over the van at the moment one of the doors needed changing which my dad was able to get another door um, it's black, not blue like the one, the colour the van is. And there you can see it's Fiat, it's basically the same thing. That was a Seat Terra camper van. Now we move on to our rusty car trailer, which needs new wheels, so we can't use it at the moment because when we did last time, some of the wheels started falling off, so that was no good. And under here lies a Fiesta XR2. So my brother's disqualified as a mechanic and this he actually bought this to be a project car but quickly lost interest. It's uh, been re-sprayed, this grey. Um, it's got quite a few paint runs near the back. And that tyre's not too bad. The whole car's not really in too bad a condition. I think it used to be red and my brother's got all the engine and stuff at home and it's currently staying here at storage until my brother figures out what he wants to do with it. And here's a 2007 uh, Ford Transit that we rescued because the engine was knackered. Now my dad's obviously got the broken tra grey Transit at home, so he was gonna what was he, he was gonna turn this one into a camp van actually. So get the engine sorted and get this one into a camp van. So we only bought it cheap because the engine's knackered. It's actually like a crew cab one, so it's got seats in the back as well as lots of rubbish at the moment. There's all parts of the van in there. But apart from that, bodywork's not too bad. A bit green, obviously. But this one day might be our camper van when my dad gets around to it. And that's what we keep at our storage compound. Oh, and the caravan over there.
So if I just walk past our caravan, we've obviously we share this compound with a few other people, so there's a few other caravans which people store here. But under tarpaulins there are a lot of old Toyota Celicas, I believe. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Here's one of them which isn't quite covered up. Goodness knows what you're going to do with nine old rusty sleekers. You're never going to get around to fixing them all. The backs look pretty cool though. ST2000 that one says. But that's not all because he's also got another few Toyotas around the corner. I'll show you the rest. So in here... Let's count how many others he's got. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. He's got eight more Toyotas in this barn. So these look like a load of spare doors. Not that they're going to be any good because they're rusty as hell. They must come off the car because he's already got stored here. There's a peak of one. And then down the back, over there. Then that one with the tyre on the roof, that's another white one. I think that one in the middle there is a red one. So there's a lot of Toyota sneakers here. Alright, let's go back and sit my dad's up to now. Back into our little section. I'm going to see if this one starts, I doubt it. Mind you, sometimes she does. There's steam coming off the battery. Is that because it's wet? Yeah, well, usually she starts up, doesn't she, when you try it? Yeah, eventually. Come on, little caravan. <laughs> Think's dead. Inside the caravan. Let's try and open the door. Oh, stinging nails. Smells a bit damp, but I can't see anything. Hmm. No water coming in. Good. looks okay smells a bit damp but nothing major Let's go! 